record of three wins, one by way of knockout, and no losses. From Mississauga, Ontario, Two fighters at the center of the ring. Immediately, you can see the height differential. Hey. Daly, certainly the uh, the thicker of the two, probably the more athletic. We're going to find out. He's certainly going to move around quite a bit more, as you can see, up on his toes right away. That's great distance. Round one scheduled for four. Daly's going to use all of that ring. You're going to see him all over the place. Very accomplished basketball player as well. Played at Sheridan College. You can see he's going to use all all of that ring. Sometimes moving a little bit like a basketball player. He's a little bit like a defender. Certainly knows what he's doing. Sometimes criticized for moving just a bit too much, but some kinks that he's going to work out as his career progresses. There you go. So taking his time on the outside. Oh, and a solid right hand. I mentioned Bull, an MMA fighter as well. He's been knocked out in all three of his MMA losses. So we're certainly going to see what's going to happen with his chin. Certainly some questions that are going to be answered. I said, put something together. Just put them together, right? You got to touch him first. You got to touch him with a small one. Bull pressing touch forward in that southpaw stance. Leaning back just a little bit, giving an opening for that right hand. Daly found it once. Is he going to throw? Daly getting low on the defensive there. Bring a very low strike zone. Solid. Daly able to get low, not giving a target. Bull pulling back, giving him a lane. He's managed to keep him at bay. Put him together. Really three solid shots thus far in this round. Nothing too substantial. Bull not showing anything on that left hand. Nothing really to worry Daly. Got to wonder if he's going to get a little bit more aggressive. His stance is certainly less passive than it was to begin the round. Looking for openings now. Not trying to get around that ring. Ten seconds left. You can hear Sid Vanderpool encouraging Daly to get in there. He's getting on the inside. Ooh, a solid right and a left at the bell. But then again, there have not been too many MMA fighters who were able to make the leap to boxing and be successful. So we're going to find out on a hard right hand floors. Taylor Bull. Just as we were talking about that chin, we're going to get some answers immediately. Daly looking confident. Not rushing in, giving himself space. Another right hand as he comes in. Uh, yeah, okay, thank you. Not a lot on it. Landed as he was stepping forward, so not all kinds of leverage. Another right as Bull steps back. Another right hand. Almost exclusively right hands from Denton Daly, and they've all landed here in the second round. Scheduled for four. There you go. Just touch him. You don't gotta touch him. Just touch him. Bull looks like he still has his legs about him, but he's eating more shots than he has before. These are vicious shots landing. Another one, and Bull through the ropes. Daly wisely does not hit his points. He's accumulated, taken away. Looking confident. Getting wide on some of these shots. If he can place them, he could probably get Bull out of here. Bull not looking steady at all. He looked fine just 20 seconds ago, but now certainly in trouble as he's desperately trying to throw back. There you go. And this is the one thing about Daly. He's, he's going to pick his shots all the time. And Bull now bleeding out of the nose. Time's getting desperate for Bull here in a four-round affair. Another right hand. And Bull just hanging on right now. And he leans over to try to... And as I say that, the ref calls it off, and probably wisely. That battle.
route was only going one way. And that was horizontally for Taylor Bull. And probably, almost definitely was saved from further punishment. Very solid performance from Denton Daly. He had questions in the first round, but whether he was gonna hit and hold his way, maybe do unanimous decision. But he gave himself all the space that he needed. And you can see the results on Taylor Bull's face. Only took him about two minutes to carve him up in that manner. You can see just right hands landing with ease almost exclusively. Again, Bull just too off balance. His chin too much of a target for Denton Daly. And he capitalized each and every time did so very quickly. Sid Vanderpool has to be pleased. His instructions were certain.